and welcome back to 25 Sweepies. Today for you, I am going to be swatching part one of the Zoya Splash Collection. This was recently sent to me for review, and since it already came out a few weeks ago, I thought it would be beneficial to break up the collection into two videos so I could get the video footage out to you quicker. So today we are kind of looking at the pinks and the reds in this collection, and then tomorrow we'll be going over the rest of the collection plus a topper. So let's get into these and start swatching them. First up we have a shade called Jody, and Jody is kind of a pink that has like a lavender undertone in it and it is a really pretty shade. As you guys can see here, this first coat is kind of streaky or patchy you would say. And I do honestly believe this is just because of the brush not being this like kind of common now bigger paddle brush. However, Zoya does have those if you want to purchase that additionally and put it in the bottle, but I would rather it just come with it. But that's my personal preference. And it's the same situation with Emma here. Emma is a really pretty shade in the bottle. It kind of feels like it's going to be a uh, kind of a peachy orange. However, on the nails, it does look a bit more orange. And as you guys can see, the first coat isn't great, but the second coat does cover in full coverage. And I think this polish would be like really great with a bigger brush. So I will probably switch it out, but I want to show it to you kind of the default way that the polishes come. Next up, we have a shade called Leilani, and this shade is just beautiful. It is a shimmering pink that has like a orangey gold shimmer in it as well, and it is loaded. It's kind of a foily finish and I absolutely love it. It works perfectly fine with this brush. You wouldn't have to switch this over to a big brush. It goes on perfectly in two coats and it's it's just beautiful. I love it. It's so fun and different and bright and happy. Then the next shade we have is Sealy and this is kind of a red version of Leilani and it is again really pretty and for red I really like this. It kind of has a bit more of a yellow orange shimmer running throughout it. But for red, this is like really pretty and I like it. It does remind me of a few previous Zoya nail polishes, so we'll be grabbing those for a dupe check video in the near future. And if you see any of these polishes and have anything in your head that you think, hey, that might look like, let me know down below. Um, this last shade for this video is called Greta, and this is your standard cream red. And it does have a really nice formula. As you guys can see, the first coat is really, really good. And I am going to go ahead and do a second coat just because I always like the feeling of two coats of a polish. And of course, that makes it perfect. And then here is a look at the first half of the collection. So the first half, first half also includes a topper but because it is a topper it looks better on darker colors so I'm going to be showcasing that in tomorrow's video. So be sure to come back tomorrow to check that video out where it will be looking at the last half of this collection and then in days following that we're going to be doing some dupe checking videos. So if you guys have seen any polishes in this video or in tomorrow's video that you think hey that kind of reminds me of insert Zoya polish name here. Let me know down below in the comments. I've already had some requests, so I'm going to be going through my Zoya collection and checking to see what I have, and I'll be getting some dupe check videos ready for you guys. So, I think that is officially it. These are available now on Zoya's website. They do also now have hand sanitizer, so if you're still having some troubles finding that in stores near you, you guys can pick that up on the Zoya website. And be checking their social channels a lot because they have been running a lot of different sales. Earlier this week it was for National Nail Polish Day and they just seem to be running a lot more things lately. So I think that is officially it now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a wonderful day and staying safe and healthy. And I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye!